Hey everyone, welcome to my channel. This is Esther from Esther's Orchids and this evening I am going to do an emergency repotting on the Pathio Padalum that I managed to knock out of its pot last night while I was filming and trying to uh, pull out a PowerPoint. So it is this one here, Pathio Padalum Hansingi Citron times Hansingi Gavicum. So uh, it is isn't quite as I expected last night when I had a look at it this evening when I picked it up and it's kind of dried a little because it didn't get put back in the pot well last night the big long root is actually with the oldest fan that flowered and as I've looked at it it's come undone so I've decided I'm going to pot them into some smaller pots which will be these two little black ones just sitting here um, they're deep, deeper than what it was in before, um, but smaller. And I'm going to attempt to pop this one up um, and see if it will give me another baby. Because the one that I expected had the big long root actually has not completely formed its own root system yet. It only has that little bit there and it is still living off the very small amount of a root system that the previous fan has all my leaf growth looks uh, healthy enough so I am definitely going to try this one by itself and uh, see if that will keep forming some roots so what I'm going to do is um, I've got a mix here of it was in tiny chip and sphagnum if I can get some light on there it's going into a mixture of um, bark chips I've had soaking and fern fibre I don't want to go completely into fern fibre because that holds its moisture a lot and it was already really really damp out of the pot that it came from so what I am going to do is cut these roots here so I have um, put some alcohol on my trusty little pruners here and I am just going to cut that old root system off because that is not going to do any good and then we are going to Put that one into a pot by itself it's uh, definitely the growth season so you never know when it's got nothing else growing beside it it might decide that it has to do a baby and start a new fan as well and then pot up the separate this one separately so what i'll do is i'll come back when they're both potted and we'll have a look at them before i finish the video so here my two plants are completely uh, repotted I've tried to put this one quite firmly into the pot and pack it down a little bit so that it has got fern fibre or moist bark touching all those parts of the small root system in the hope that this one's going to keep growing really well. This one, I don't really know. It may provide another fan um, now that it feels that it hasn't got anything else growing off it. It might trigger it to um, create another fan, but it had already created this one here. So one fan always grows off the other, like this one's growing off that one. So this one may or may not decide to provide another fan and therefore another baby. And I may have just subdivided my plant unintentionally, or divided it, I shouldn't say subdivided, divided my plant um, successfully, but uh, wasn't intentional. It was just probably as it hit the floor, it shook the, the plant apart a bit more than it was. And I gave it a little bit of a helping hand when I picked it up wrong. And uh, it's ended up as two plants. Let's see what happens. Cheers, everybody. Thanks for watching. Have a great evening or morning or afternoon. Thank you.